Oh. Oh. Oh this is my friend Ryan, and yes, he did get punched by a two-year-old. Ryan is probably the funniest <laughs> guy I know. Got punched by a two-year-old. <laughs> and this is my friend Josh, the goofiest person I met. And yep, that's me. My friend Sam, probably the most clumsiest person they've ever met. So what happens when three filmmakers go on a trip together? Nothing can go wrong, right? Or everything. But I guess that's part of the story. It's not getting out. It's not getting out. We lost the Jeep. So welcome to a place that I've wanted to go to for a long time and a story of three friends who went on an adventure of a lifetime. Two a.m. Six now. Two a.m. Two a.m. Yeah, eight hours sleep if we sleep at six p.m. Do you believe in us? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> I mean, not yet. Not yet. Okay. I we'll I think. Yeah, we'll prove it, right? Good morning, everybody. So it is currently. What time is it? One forty-two. Yep, that's the time that we're waking up, actually. And we're about to go to Bromo, and I'm actually so excited because I've been wanting to go here for so long. But, oh my gosh, I don't even know how tired I'm going to be at the top. And apparently it's so cold, so we're all putting on so many freaking layers. <laughs> he has two pairs of pants on. How many tops? I don't even like know. Three. Three? Five and four. Oh, jeez. How did you guys sleep from one to ten? I two. kept waking up. Two? But I woke up with so many bug bites on my back, like 10. Are you sure there's bugs? I don't know. Weren't you sleeping with a sweater? But it's, bugs. but like, there's dots on my, like, it itches. <laughs> I'm scared. I think that might be like bed bugs or ticks or something. Ew, ticks. I don't, I don't know. Why would it be ticks? Or bed bugs? No. Bugs. Don't tell me that. Yeah, we did indeed get bed bugs. Or spider Don't bugs? Say that. Ew, that one's the Not worst. Not spider one bugs, yet. spiders. I bought some gloves. I bought a hat. I'm ready. <laughs> I can't even walk up here. There's so many Jeeps. What is happening? It is hour three, and we finally got to the base of Bromo, and we're sitting at a cafe right now, but I am so cold. Like, half of the bottom of my face is freezing. Ryan's already, he's definitely cold. He's just fine. I'm good. I don't know how he's fine in these weather conditions, but I'm not, I'm not okay. But it's fine. Woo, it's gonna be worth it, right? Yeah. Let's go. That looks really good. I'm gonna have some. Oh, <laughs> I'm I'm tired and cold, but I feel good. We're we're looking at the sunset now. Sunrise. Oh. <laughs> See, can you tell I'm tired? There's actually a lot of people here. Some people are literally like sleeping. Like I don't know how long they've been here, but <laughs> it seems like they've been sleeping. <laughs> we made it. We made it, we found a different viewpoint. It's way less crowded and a way better view of Bromo. Look at this. Oh my gosh, it's so magical. This guy wants to go all the way up there. <laughs> Ryan. <laughs> no. This is so hard. This is difficult. get from here no. to down. You're kidding. We're not kidding, but he's trying. And I'm so scared for his life right now. Oh. How, how long of a jump is it? God bless these people who are coming to home. People are so nice. People are nice. Are you like, hold, no, can you catch me? With I will catch you. I can't catch you. Like, I need to hold on to the tree. Otherwise, we're both going under the edge. Trust. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I was scary. <laughs> What do you mean it's not very land? I'm scared. Oh, I know, I know. Me too. Oh my. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I was just clearing my eyes and then you were suddenly on top of me. <laughs> I fell. Do not jump. I jumped. You're tall. 
Yeah, you're fucking tall. I've got further to go. No, like you can touch the ground faster. No, grab, your grab your shoulder. <laughs> Great. That was cute. That was cute. Uh, up in my There's so much dust and sand in my mouth, and in my nose, and on my throat. We lost the Jeep. And my mic. <laughs> and the mic. But we made it down. We made it down. I don't know how we did this, but we did. I don't know how that happened, but we found him. We found it. He's deep asleep and we're in the middle of off-roading. Oh, oh shoot. Oh no. What's happening? <laughs> um, we might be a little stuck. Really? So, our Jeep is stuck <laughs> in the, it's not mud, I don't even know what type of, in the sand. We can't get out, we kept trying to get out, but now the guy's really mad and we might have to call for help. So, her Jeep literally is stuck in the sand right now. <laughs> and we have an emergency Jeep. That's not getting out. It's not getting out. Oh my god. Right. <laughs> yes! Woo! Woo! I'm actually surprised how many Jeeps there are here. I don't know, every time I see it on Instagram, there's like no one, just one person. This whole sand place to themselves. But look how many people here. It feels like an amusement park or something. Guys, is it bad that I'm already out of breath? And we still have a 30 minute hike to do climbing the crater. What is, I don't know why I'm like this, honestly, but I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna climb that crater and you're gonna see me on that crater with everybody. Okay. <laughs> oh no, bye. <laughs> Almost there. <laughs> we have made it. Wow. Oh, look at that view though. We literally started all the way we started back there. You see that? We started back there at the parking lot. And we climbed all the way here. That's freaking crazy. Just got to the Bromo creator. Creator? Creator. Creator. A little bit scary because I have no idea if this thing is going to erupt or not. And we're not going to get a warning if it ever erupts again. I think it erupted like last year. Is that correct? Yeah, I think so. And it like was very damaging. So how are you supposed to know this thing's not gonna erupt today? And there's no guardrails, no nothing. I'm there's just a cliff. Just cliff and lava. Does it all agree to go on someone's horse? I'm ready. So Isabel decided to take a horse instead. Because we're actually running out of time and we're already supposed to be down by the parking lot, so So we just got transported to this colorful village and I don't know exactly what it is yet or what it's for, but it's such a vibe. Like there's little kittens. I feel like we've been transported somewhere. Right? Like inside a coloring book. We're in a different world right now. Like, <laughs> literally just this circus like, kite. Oh my gosh. <laughs> like we are the balls. circus. Yeah, what is what even are these balls? I kinda wanna touch one. Can I take a photo of you? So we're on top of the bridge right now, and look, look at this. I don't even know where I feel like I am right now. This is beyond beautiful. The houses here are just gorgeous. That is art. That is majestic. Josh, was that you? Yeah. That was you. That is me. That is you. It's, it's an accurate it's painting. It's a self-portrait. It's a self-portrait. Oh, there's this battle happening. Oh my god. This is unfair. You have a knife, have a camera. Okay. Oh, run! <laughs> That's a mood. I was so thirsty. Yeah. In the 
next episode of Isabel's vlog. Like, guys, we're I, stuck. Wait, wait, we're stuck? I can feel it. We're running out of fuel and we I don't know feel where it. we are. There it is. So nice. <laughs> I don't even think we're halfway yet. Though. Oh my god. And then that way, the bridge has fallen down. The bridge has <laughs> fallen down? So we're stuck. Wait, wait. Cool. Oh, no, please, 